The Norwich Public Schools are giving students a say about what's on the menu. The kids taking part in the blind taste test, helping to determine what items will eventually make the cut and end up on school lunch menus. News 8's Ken Pierce is in Norwich with all the dish. It's not lunchtime, it's the middle of the morning, but these kids are lining up to eat. They've got an important job. Sample three varieties each of a bunch of different lunch foods the schools are planning on serving next year. The kids rate them on their scorecards. And then the item that gets the most votes will be what we serve next year. At 10 different tables, kids are sampling everything from meatballs to quesadillas and, of course, mac and cheese. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's one. Your favorite one. Mm -hmm. Number two. Mm. Oh, that's very good. But it's really about what the kids like, and there were four tables just for pizza. What are you looking for in a good pizza? What makes a pizza good? Um, good sauce. Okay, you're all about the sauce. All right. And this sauce was pretty good? Yeah. I'll look for the type of cheeses that's on it, like, like Swiss cheese, like plain American cheese on it. That's how it's cooked in the oven. Now, Norwich Public Schools are part of the School Nutrition Association of Connecticut. Yes, that acronym works out to SNACKED. And as such, I'm told that all of these choices, right down to the macaroni and cheese, they're all healthier than the food I grew up on eating at school lunch. Everything that is out here is whole grain and low fat and low sodium. But that's not the part that interests these kids. Yeah, I get to miss math, which is awesome, so. Well, she may be missing math, but all in the name of science, food science. In Norwich, I'm Kent Pierce, News 8.